Hello, my Pisces cross watchers. How are you guys doing? What is going on? You are here to find out what a Pisces thinking, doing, feeling, saying, and whatever. Pisces are a trip. But we, as of earth sign, I love water signs. I get along well with Pisces. Um, so let's get into this. I know you guys have been having some rough times, a lot, or you know, with your Pisces. If you're the, if any of them in the past have resonated, let's go see if it's gotten better, guys. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. If you get triggered, let's own it. That way you can think about it. Really cross it off your list of something that you've healed, forgiven, and moved on. If you can't own it, I don't want people here that can't own their stuff. I've had enough of that in my life. Okay, so let's go. Led by God, guided by you. I just found, like, once I came back into my spiritual self and where I belong and I feel comfortable and I feel good, even though it was pushed down by me and others, you know, coming out of nightlife and all that, like, I find so many people that can't own it. As hard as it is, I'll look you in your face and say, yes, I did that. How can I fix this? What should we do? But people don't do that. Led by God, guided by you. I mean, I'm so around so many excuse makers. It's so funny now that I'm in my awareness and I've been through my awakening, <clears throat> which I clearly need to speak up to these people to own their shit because I'm so tired. Of, it's excuse central. Led by God, guided by you. Friends, family, employees, whatever. It doesn't matter. It's always an excuse. It's never ownership. Led by God, guided by you. <clears throat> I guess I need to speak up about that. <laughs> Let's go for Pisces. What are they thinking, feeling, doing? What is going on? Last one out. It's Pride Weekend here in Vegas. Very excited. I'm not doing the whole weekend. I'm going to do one or two events and leave it alone. Because I have other things I want to do this weekend. But I am excited. And I've already attended three of the Prides this weekend. So this year. So I'm excited to just go for a couple hours. I used to run the Pride down here in Vegas. Uh, I used to run the floats. I used to make sure all the bars were stocked. I ran my ass off. I'd be done on the end of the weekend and I'd be exhausted. And let me tell you, and the LGBT, I don't know why I'm saying this. I probably, I'm going to save it. I'm gonna the lesbians do all the heavy lifting. They got to forgive their ex. I'm telling you, there's been something in there it, themselves. The last few reads. And they, they sacrificed all for love. Okay. I feel that they sacrificed a lot for the, the you being the past person or you, that's in a relationship. I feel like you guys can, or, you know, if there's a new, if you're a new love, they're still forgiving for what they sacrificed for that person. Hmm. Let's go find out. It's hard to sacrifice everything for love. You get it, and you do it to yourself by doing so, and then you're even more hurt and more madly. But you did it. <laughs> but when you're in love, you want to sacrifice. You want to, you want to give your all, and you want to, you know. I don't know. Led by God, guided by you. Let's go. There might have been a tower moment that has questioned their money a little bit here. Led by God, guided by you. For Pisces, what are they thinking, doing, feeling, and saying? Let's go. Got the babies up to the mountains early for a hike. <laughs> so now, oh, by the way, she's going to start snoring. She just came in here. The last two weeks, she was out there. I found out my boxer snores a lot on these guys. I do not li like to watch my reads, and I'm so deep into them that I didn't realize how loud she is. Led by God, guided by you. But you guys, boxers are uh, shorts now, and they're going to be loud. Led by God, guided by you. Can we get that tower somewhere else, please? I'm tired of looking at that. It's been in reverse, though, most of my this, this series, so that's a good thing. Let's go. What's in uh, Pisces Energies? Let's go. Go to my Monday morning fills. I gave out two prizes this week only. I wanted to give ten. So I'm going to give 10 next week. I think it's going to be better over there to do it. You just need to subscribe. I'll send you out your tarot deck. I'll call you and set up your point or email you and set you up your reading, appointment for your reading, everything that did go win this week. 
I let people choose right now until I get too many, because I will. And uh, they chose tarot deck, so, deck, so I like it. Okay, so it's the Wheel of Fortune. The lighting right now is crazy for you guys, right? So maybe if I put them down here. I love to read by natural light, though, guys. So they feel they're going to finally move forward. If they forgive this ex, they will move forward and happy. Look at her. She's happy and balanced. Because you see how she's standing on one That's a balanced person that could stand on one foot. But see how happy she is? Spice is going to be happy moving forward. They, got, they have to forgive. We have to forgive our exes, guys. We have to. Nobody wants to be with somebody that can't even forgive their ex. Because guess what? They're still really... This is a major story. Yeah, they're moving into justice. They're getting justice from what happened in their past relationship. And they're going to move forward into luck. I'm loving this. It's great. We do have a Libra here. I wish fulfillment. There they go, showing up Pisces. I don't usually do minors, but that is a Pisces card. Yeah, they're moving right in after getting justice into their wish fulfillment. Because they gave a lot to the last relationship. So they're getting everything they want out of the new one, out of you, out of the next person, out of the new job. What's this wish fulfillment? What's this wish fulfillment? What's this wish fulfillment? What's the nine of cups and justice? They got justice after sacrifice. I think the other person, they gave, 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 sacrificed everything for them. And then they screwed them over. And it took a while for them to forgive them. But they're forgiving them. Yep. What? 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 What is there? Uh, nine of Cups. Oh. I am loving this for Pisces right now because Pisces is uh, the cross the board, the worst cross watchers in the last few months. You go on Pisces with yourself because your Nine of Cups is what? The sun, a lot of fire, happy, damnness, and abundance. I can't love this read more than anything right now. I wish this would have been Virgos or even Libras because I have a lot of Libra in me. Wow. I want to leave it. <laughs> they got clarity. Jeez. This Pisces is really heading towards wish fulfillment, happiness, and abundance. What else could they want? And I want to leave it here, but I can't. The last time I took a story, oh. why is this lovers in reverse? Look how many majors. One, two, three, four. And the other one's a nine and a ten. What's this lover in reverse for? Why are they in reverse? What, are they, what is it? They're, I think they're from abundant after they know that they, okay. They went within another major and another major. Guys, this is a major for Pisces, okay? They went after an, a, a, introspection. They made the choice not to be with somebody because an emperor has in, entered their life. And then, of course, I got my mom's dog that comes in, and she she went to the vet today. She's doing good. We did have to start her on prednisone, though. I don't like that, but it is what it is. It's going to help her. Yeah, after they went in, they found out that, you know, they had a choice to stay stuck in their head about somebody else that's already moved on or, you know, isn't good for them. And, and no, they're choosing an emperor. They're choosing the emperor or they're being the emperor. Let's see. Who's the emperor? I'm telling you, I still They're making a choice to leave a soulmate behind, guys, because they're emperoring up after being in hermit mode. So I was wrong. They didn't choose me to an emperor. They're choosing to become the emperor after choosing not to be with this lover because they see all of everything else that they can have. As soon as they, they, but they did know that this was a soulmate to them. 
This Pisces is single, happy, feeling confident, and free. They will be feeling that. And I see there. You see it. Look at all this. And balanced out, okay? After what? A three of, uh, a three of swords in reverse. Making the judgment call that they're not going to sit in self-regret, self-pity, and with somebody that didn't do them right. And they don't, they can't sit there and think about how much they sacrificed anymore. They got to just go and balance themselves out. Okay, let's go. A lot of twos here too, guys. Two might be important. They were at a crossroads for a while. And they still may be a little bit. They still may be because I still feel there's some forgiveness for them to get so that they go through this. But they know they're, they're, they're reaching this because this is in their energies already. I said, what is in their energies? They know that this is happening. All because they made a choice. Boss up. Made the choice not to be with this person. Okay. But they're still in a little bit of a crossroads. Why are they in a crossroads? I think a new love's entering their lives. Or a new friendship or a new job. Why is Pisces at a crossroads? What's going on? What's going on here? Yeah, they don't want to be guarded. They don't want to have burdens of, the, of being guarded anymore. So they're at the crossroads of how do I let this my guard down? Because I want to let it down. It's too burdensome to carry. It's not going to happen anymore. I want to let my guard down. I want to meet somebody. I want to be happy. I want to be in my ten of, ten of Pentacles with this family. With this family. Balanced. With wish fulfillment. Happy. Like, happy. So they want to come out of being guarded. And part of that was forgiving their ex. You will always be guarded as long as you're, you're forgiving your ex. They want, they're at a crossroads of who am I planting my new seeds with? Who am I wanting to invest? Who, why am, I wait and what do I want to grow with this person? I'll wait and I'll watch. I think they're planting little seeds here and there. I don't even think it's just one person. I think they have a few options that they're looking at as they're putting their guards down and forgiving the sex. Good for them. Two of Wands making that decision too. Yep, they're going to. Two is again. So two, again, two might be important to you guys. She was in reverse. The Queen of Pentacles was in reverse. So they're completing out a betrayal. So if you don't see this person giving a lot of themselves... Um, they definitely are coming out of some big trail and they're really not giving yet, but I, I feel that it's still resident residue of this guardedness and this 10 of wands. They, they're finally putting down. Okay, guys. And by putting it down means that they, they've healed. They're ready to move on. They're ready to forgive that ex. And honestly, I don't know. I think they feel abundant and happy just being with themselves. And I get that. Sometimes this is easier. Sometimes you do better. You do more. You do, I don't know. But it's also great to be in a relationship. It's a wonderful to be in a relationship, a right one. One that's loving and caring. But I don't think this one's ready to go yet. But they're, yes, I was say, but they're completing out a cycle. And here she is, the world. Completing out that cycle. They did. They, re, yeah. They got a page of wands here. They got a little, and an ace of wands next to each other. They are ready to go look and start something with somebody else slowly and slowly. Okay, so if this is you, they are very much happy. They are, are very much looking to balance themselves out. They got the jealous. They're moving in their wheel of fortune. They're, they, you know, they're going to make their wish fulfillment, their ten of pentacles, their happiness be theirs. And by doing so, they could put down their Ten of Wands. They could put down their guard because they're confident enough to know that they could go plant seeds somewhere else now. And they're choosing to do so. Just kind of very 
I don't want to say stingy, just not as guarded, but they're not as giving to this. They're kind of waiting to see what shoe's going to drop. Okay. But they are they're having the patience. They're willing to work with somebody. Okay. Build memories. Move forward, Cherry. Okay. So, guys, we do have a majors out here. I didn't read the signs. I forgot to in the other ones, but there wasn't a lot of majors like this. So, uh, you do have Libra. I did read one minor, which is Pisces themselves. Um, you have Aries. You have Gemini. You have Leo. Virgo. And... That's it. She's about to start to snore, so I'm checking it out. Okay? Let's see. <laughs> she was so loud on there. I can't believe it. It wasn't just that one. I love Leo. That's my that's my right back. My girl. I love my boy too, but they know that they gotta finish up something, wrap it up. They are. They knew time was ticking on them, too, to do so. They know they have to finish up by forgiving that ex. They sacrificed a lot, but they're ready to, and willing now. They're letting go because they see the potential of all that damn beauty. If you saw that, you're not going to hold back either. You'll get the forgiveness done, and you're going to move on. And I don't even know if this Pisces is moving on with anybody, so... You take it as it resonates. Go watch the moon rising and sun. I got guided by you last one out. I did that weird. I cleaned my table before I was done my read. I don't normally do that. <laughs> I get zoned out, guys. I don't pay attention sometimes. That's why I didn't even know half the time the noise in the background of my videos until I was told the other night. <laughs> they want flexibility. I'm telling you. They want to be flexible within their lives, within their energies of just being free and happy and wish fulfillment's in abundance. I don't think the sweet this Pisces wants a relationship right now. Yeah, they want a new life. They're getting one. If I've seen any read so far do this, Pisces is getting a new life. And they feel blessed. I mean, <laughs> I love it. If you are dealing with the Pisces, I'm just going to tell you this. Hang out with them for a little bit. They just want to have fun right now. They see their new life on the horizon, and you could be a part of it. Now, if you're the old Pisces, I'm sorry. They're going to forgive you, and they're going to move on. That's what happens. The good part is they're forgiving you. And you need to forgive them so everybody could just be happy and free to go do what they want, right? All right. Well, that was great. Please check out my Monday morning fills. Uh, let me get you a prize out. Um, they come up at 5 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Um, I'll tell you in there how to win a prize. And then I will get it out by the next weekend. Like I'm mailing these out. Anyways, guys, you be blessed. You be well. And bye.